All right, people. Welcome back. More Dianto commentary. So we are joined by Mega Chaos. Hi, Omega Chaos here. So, Mega Chaos, are you ready for the playoffs? Are you ready for your uh, semifinal? Mm, not really. <laughs> you, you enjoyed that bye week, but now it's time. <laughs> yeah, I know. I haven't, been, I haven't been playing too much Yu-Gi-Oh lately. I don't blame you. This game is kind of right now. <laughs> We're in that stalemate phase where unless we get this new list, we're just kind of in the same rut we've always been. So yeah, pretty much. Norden. So it's Necros versus Zephra. I guess so. I mean, that Zephra is nice and all, but he'll probably be able to get over it this turn. <laughs> you know, we got Demonic Reshlam. It's 694. And we got Milos 12341. 11-16, okay. I, one, I didn't even know people still played Book of Book Cups, and two, yeah, and I guess... Yeah, Book of Cups is useless, now that Chain is banned. Mm-hmm. Chain is banned. You don't have to worry about the, the gin locks. So I don't know what you're doing with Book of Eclipse. The only semi-similar lock we have is with Towers, and Towers is not affected by books of, Book of Eclipse. I don't know what you're doing with that card, but... Hey, you're using Necro, so that obviously means that you're pro. So, hello. <laughs> it's all the Necros. I still don't know what's what's the tier. People, there is no tier. I just need some general idea. What what are, what are the best decks? Well, Necro is definitely one of them. That's for sure. And probably Shadows and uh, Burning Abyss. Mm. And that's about it, it really. And maybe Clifford's and Satellites. So just the usual? Yeah, pretty much like like the past year, pretty much. <laughs> yep. Okay. Mm. Kind of unusual move. Mm hmm. Okay, well, there's no point in exitoning. Yeah, can't really exiton, it will be equal. Mm-hmm. But he's gonna go for it! Oh. Hmm, time on Tower Wolf, I guess, to bait out that back row. I guess. And to clear the field so I can search for if there plus spells. Uh, I've dueled against the deck a couple of times. I only lost to it, like... Once, I want to say. <laughs> no, really. I had a damn Santa Claus got over my towers. The guy I gave the deck profile to on my channel. <laughs> I was like, you son of a bitch. And then he top deck Regeki, and then Regeki me and attacked me for a game. And how many times have we seen that? Huh? Stu versus Slate. Slate. Slate is so bad. Yeah, Slate was completely outclassed. Completely. I'm sorry, I kind of knew he wasn't gonna get very far. I was like, I don't, I doubt he's gonna be able to beat Stu. But your your two duels should be much better. You guys actually have some power behind you. <laughs> yeah, some power at least. Who do you think that you're gonna be facing in the finals if you beat Stu? Think you're gonna be facing Ryan or Lunar? Ryan. Why? <laughs> you think that gonna beat Looter? <laughs> Probably. Oh, there goes the MST. It's cleaning up your back row. You wanna, you know, do something, Mr. Zephyr guy? I see this deck kind of fell off. Seems like it's just doing too much. It's like, hey, I'm a deck that can do everything. <laughs> yeah, pretty much. <laughs> wow. I've never seen Zephyr set that much back row. I think they're more monster focused. There's really no back row there to handle any of this. Yeah, calling down your well. What's their cannon cap? What do you do? You like banish a base up one in the extra deck? Yep, and then pretty much negate anything. Wow, Oasis. I mean, do you have anything? 
that oh, was this in Sephra. It doesn't really make that much sense because mm -hmm. they got extra like Yeah, I don't I don't know where you're going here. But hey, you have a higher rating than me. So it I'll actually might be just a terrorize with Sephra. Yeah. That might yeah that's be why it. there is so much background. Yeah, you know what that might make more sense. I mean I wouldn't play Zephra whatever his name is in there, but I mean what's he do for Teller Knights? Does he do anything with Teller Knight? What's his effect? Uh, that pretty much if you're a normal pendulum summit you can destroy a face up uh, card and uh Satan Knight or Zephra on your side. Okay. So it really does nothing for Teller Knights, you just kind of don't stand yeah, alone. Not much because you can't trigger the effect if you spell the Satan Knight with Altar or anything like that. Mm. Okay, well, hopefully it's Teller Knights. Hopefully. You're scaring me, man. <laughs> I don't see Teller Knights set that often <laughs> unless you got him again. <laughs> Please don't. Please show me something. I gotta add your deck to the title of this duel, and I don't—I don't even know. The title of this video has to have the name of your deck, and right now I'm not sure. I'm right. There's this point I want to put Zephyr, and I don't want to put that. <laughs> yep. God, I wish Necro's little one worlds. Why? Yeah, kind of same here. <laughs> Why did you have to win, Teller Knight? You're good, but you're not bad. You don't deserve to be murdered. Necros deserve to be murdered. <laughs> With all yeah, of that I... hate and you still win worlds, like what the hell? It's like a non CG all they did is just what, put shit down to one and put Manju back up to three, so essentially they're at what they were at worlds. Plus yeah, Manju. That's serious. Mm hmm I do kinda like that card, but it in the Trojan opening hand, it's not that great. Yeah, we saw that at World. <laughs> said, I'd rather just go Emerald. <clears throat> That's funny if you, if you have space in the like, deck. If you don't like me, then have yeah, to use it. You have then. a lot of rank up monsters and stuff. Okay. What a Diamond Dire Wolf. Amigos here. Why is Diamond Dire Wolf more expensive than I think it should be? No idea. I'll keep Pale Iron Wall at least stop the tissue from yep. so going off. Yeah, all your stuff. So it is Teller Knights. Why do you keep on opening up this bad? <laughs> oh my god, like, you know, you still got Triple Rota and Triple Deneb and stuff. <laughs> still. <laughs> Yeah, if Saturnites don't open up the Deneb, then they are pretty much screwed, mm -hmm. mostly. I would not be surprised if they just tear down that deck's consistency. Like, we're not going to kill it, we're just going to rip it apart, consistency-wise. Yeah, we don't have any idea what Conway will do about that deck, because that deck pretty much consists of two cards, so, yeah. Mm -hmm. If you hit one of them, the deck is uh, pretty much dead. Yeah. And those two cards are, of course, Altar and Deneb. <laughs> then I'm hoping this Deneb so the deck will still be alive at least if you send that one Deneb you can still do your all tired Deneb plays and that's Konami's fault for designing uh, uh, that deck so badly that uh, only two cards are really good in that deck yep <laughs> I mean they even run an Unuk just to send the Deneb <laughs> okay Where are you going with this? <laughs> Some extra draws, I guess, to get that an app. Yes? Did you get it? Well, even if Saturn Light player player gets it, it's already too late. Oh my god. Alright. That around the crit then yeah, shut well, start. Alright, wrap it up, you let's hit. <laughs> <laughs> Dang. Oh, yes. <laughs> At top deck MST. Right, the Piran Iron Wall still yeah. goes. But I thought after the MST. Oh, uh, well, the finish chain well, right the finish still on fail, so yeah, it's still negated. Yeah. That's good. 
least you're saved from that, but you're not saved. I mean, Paragon World is nice and all, but it's better when there's nothing on the field so they can't, you know, banish your mirrors and get back into it. It's not the best when you're already staring down just a field of monsters ready to destroy you. <laughs> yeah, Nekos are pretty much no, a no decay deck at this point. Mm-hmm. Running it, them freaking clowns, of course. Yep. Yep. So, I know Norton's already being done with Trick Clown. Yeah, I might even start using the performance engine in my Heraldic Pistol in the future worlds. <laughs> That's kind of such a good rank for engine. Yeah, pretty much. Like, oh my god. Rank 4 is still just being able to be splashed in so easily and dominate the game. But we've known that since the beginning. Level 4 is the most common level in the game, so then you just splash all these powerful rank 4s. Oh, going all in, I guess. Yeah, just gonna go all in. a risky play. Yep, hopefully he doesn't have Regeki. If you have Regeki, that might be game. Clawsless grabs back uh, Necrospell. No, grabs a Necrospell and traps in the deck. Yep. Oh, well, I mean, if he has Regeki, that's gonna hurt. Hopefully you top deck into a Necros monster that you can use and... Oh, you're just gonna use a gun, right? Yep. And, uh, that's game over. Yep. I think. Yeah, that should be game. Yeah. Yeah, that's game. Yep. Wow. And, hmm, that's like a replay from Worlds, Necros is the Tullers, and, hmm, <laughs> you know, we're at like 12 minutes, should we just get another single duel or another match? If we get another match, there's a good chance we'll just go way over time. Yeah, probably. Right. We got like a 15 minute one last week, so we'll give you like a 20 minute one, so we'll just go get a single duel. Alright, we're back. Alright, back with a single. So, we got... Martin JP here with 1062. And we got Graxians with 216. The only problem is that he's got all that experience. He's got that type of cream cream picture. Graxianx went first, but didn't do anything. He just passed. So hopefully he has some plays. Martin here hmm. is using star setups. Like, okay. Yeah, pure star setups, pretty much. Yeah. Haven't seen them playing pink plates. Star Seraph have, have, been, have been only played as an engine, not as an actual deck. Alright. MST? They can't control what decks these people play, but hopefully they play something decent. Mm, Lumana is okay. Yeah, something with Atlanteans or something? It could be sharks. <laughs> <laughs> But I don't think anyone is really playing that deck. Oh, it's Geshki. Oh, Geshki. Wow, alright. I tried to get people with high rating. They were maybe hopefully using something meta related. <laughs> but I, I guess we're just gonna get something casual. <laughs> Luminize. The opponent's monster declares an attack, targets the attacking monster, negate that attack, and. One face of light monster you control gains attack equal to the equal to the target's attack until the end of your next turn. Okay, at least it's still in your next turn. But it kind of takes like one of the best things about Honest and just throws it away. <laughs> yep, not doing really it that great. <laughs> mm -mm. Keep getting all set up, so go ahead and summon him. Yo, Googies. Go ahead and put that mound of the brown, brown town crater. Yep. Okay. Is it a Gishki? Nope. <laughs> nope. Still a good card, though. Yeah, that's a good card. Pretty much, 
allow him to summon another one if he wants to. How quick will this still be? Hopefully that back row be enough to survive, kids. You wanna play the card? Yeah, first? just just kinda what the KBT is in there. Mm-hmm. Attack, attack, attack. And then Gustav Max. And Gustav Max, Vlasty. <laughs> yep. Push for another one. Oh, there's a Trundle face down. He would activate it already. God. When people say there's no good ritual. Like, this deck's pretty good. <laughs> yeah, it is. When I say if you hit the Necros cards too much, you think they would just turn and start playing the Gitchki cards for a full tribute? Depends what cards will get hit. I don't know. <laughs> Please, just just kill the deck. <laughs> I haven't won his deck dead this bad since Dragon Rollers. <laughs> I just don't want Necros to be alive anymore. <laughs> Well, I feel the same about pretty much all the current top decks. Oh my god. <coughs> wow, alright, that's probably game. <laughs> yeah, more than likely. Yeah. Should I also just, I don't want dead, I just want construct hit. Because there's too much construct. Why am I stall fusion to get hit? Blah, blah. I would kill it's the deck. <laughs> I don't want to lower the consistency of the really. fusion. If they want to go ahead and choose into one construct, one, that's fine. But multiple? No. <laughs> I'm not even paying attention to this guy's play anymore. I'm, I'm lost. This guy just went completely off and then I'm done. <laughs> oh, that card. <laughs> what? I have never seen that Gishki before. It's one of the level 8 ones. It's decent, I guess. But not really played that much. <laughs> oh, all three of them. Oh my god. Oh. I heard you like the other biggest. Well, it has to be a monster, so I can't, can't shuffle anything. Yep. So, all of them just missed. Please have honest, please have honest, please have honest. <laughs> Lots. That'd be funny as hell. <laughs> of course not. Uh, nigga, what really? The, wait, lol, what the fuck? What the fuck? <laughs> wow, alright. Alright. Went all in and got punished for it. Seriously, <laughs> what was that? What was that, dude? You had all that. Oh my god. You ran into one honest and quit. You still have two gigases left. Wait, no. That's not game. That's not even game. It's not even game. You would just take 15. Like, really? Why'd you quit? Fucking pussy, really? I'm mad. I'm mad at you. Why are you gonna go <laughs> balls deep, go all in, and then if you don't get it, quit? It's not like he even. If you do that regeki at you, then yeah, I can understand why you quit, but you didn't even know he had that regeki. You quit right on the honest, whatever. You should have known. You should have known, man. Honest is at 3 in the OCD because they're stupid. Whatever. Well, not many play honest nowadays. Oh my so. god, if I was one up to three. That's fine. Fucking Cosmos would be jumping for joy. <laughs> That's crazy. Yeah, it's very really, really powerful. Whatever. <laughs> I have my sides for Cosmos, I have my hate. Anyway. But Cosmos currently is very bad, so. Yeah. You just need to see what those other two cards are. Yeah, Dark Monster and some Equip spell as well. Of course I get a dark monster. <laughs> You're gonna throw BLS in that damn deck. <laughs> <laughs> you better not. <laughs> Alright, so. Yeah, I'll just call it here. I, I, I'm so disappointed that I was just... Mm. God, your Facebook is going off like crazy. <laughs> oh, sorry about that. I should have closed it. <laughs> anyway, I hope that you guys enjoyed. Short episode. Comparison to that long episode. So thank you Omega for joining me. No problem. Glad to join as always. Thanks for watching. Thanks for all the support. And we will see you guys next week with another damn commentary. Alright, people. Thanks for watching.